So, these people, they've already searched the whole car. They brought, they, were, they brought in a King Charles Spaniel. Can you believe that? Of all dogs, a King Charles Spaniel just searched the car. So they've already done a they've done a forensic. I've got that on video. They've done a forensic, a forensic of the car. Um, no, they're still they've still got you know, obviously they've got things that got to be done put in place before they can do that. And they've already um, searched the car. I suppose they're waiting for somebody to come and tow it now, but. So I'll, I'll show you from this angle again that this car is facing the gates of Buckingham Palace. Uh, literally, I was about an hour ago. I was filming at the barracks. I wasn't supposed to be here today. If I actually came up here an hour ago, nothing was here then. I came back around about half an hour later after I was filming the barracks, and that car was there. So he's been arrested, but what his motive was was I don't know. A man drove up to Buckingham Palace about an hour ago, about half an hour ago, and dumped his car outside and was arrested. So we don't know. We don't know. I don't know the full story, but he's been arrested. So they brought in the sniffer dogs. They've got the armed police here. I just wish I'd been here. I really do wish I'd been here. I'm grateful for the footage that I did get, but it would have been absolutely fantastic if I had got the guy being arrested. But then saying that, that, that could have gone kaboom, couldn't it? And then nobody was here to report anything. Arm police. Guys, can you put FYP, hashtag FYP, um, Buckingham Palace in the um, chat, please? Hashtag FYP, hashtag Buckingham Palace. One of the two. Thanks guys, FYP, can somebody put hashtag back in the palace, possible attack. When you put Buckingham Palace, put it all as one word, don't leave a gap in it, because it, it doesn't pick up as a hashtag. If you put um, Buckingham Palace as two words, the hashtag and Buckingham Palace must be all one word, and hashtag FYP must be all one word. That's it guys, we're done. Because if we search people, this will go out the news by now, people will be searching for it, I'm live on the scene. A man drove up to this car and got right to the gates of Buckingham Palace 
and was arrested and his car was taken away. Unfortunately, guys, I wasn't here when the guy was arrested. I came up after it happened. But I've got all the car being searched by the dogs in it. So guys, hashtag Buckingham Palace. They cut no, it's not illegal to film that. This is a public walkway. Yeah, they've dealt with him, yes. I've got him on camera saying he's been dealt with. The person who drove the car has been arrested and has been taken away. No, it's not cold. It's not, it's not that cold at the moment. Thank you for the roses. So guys, possibly could be a... Do you know what? How I guard that? the dummy run for a terrorist attack now it is, it is on Sunday it is um, Remembrance Sunday and this has happened today on, a, on the Thursday leading up to that and whilst there are rehearsals going on right now at Wellington Barracks which is that white building just through those trees and I've already been down there and filmed a lot of footage from there today and that will go up later but we come up here and look what happens He's going to drive it. He's going to drive it away. It's been taken away now. He's going to drive it away. Oh, it's outside Buckingham Palace right now, and this car is about to get removed. Guys, if you're just tuning in right now, this car was dumped outside the gates of Buckingham Palace um, and the man was arrested. So the armed police and the sniffer dogs all turned up. The police have now removed the car, driven it away to impound it now. So that car will go to the car pound. So there we go. There go the armed police officers.